Hi everyone, I'm back to share with you my final layout for my 25 days of Christmas for 2011. I have Christmas Day here and what I've done is I've taken a piece of pattern paper for my mind's eye for my background. It already had the glittered embellishment and the sleigh and that sort of thing up here in the top left of the paper and then in the bottom right there is this embellishment here with the glitter again and the Santa and that was bottom right but it was on one sheet of paper however my layout size is eight and a half by eight and a half so I actually needed two pieces of paper otherwise cutting up would have cut into each section of the other one so this is actually two pieces of 12 by 12 same paper cut down and in different sections so then I also added here uh, the reindeer which is a rub on and then over here I have another rub on from that sheet and then this is an embellishment from the the punch die punch that you can get from my mind's eye and I just added some rhinestones here and then these are their chipboard embellishments these actually little pennant things spelt out Merry Christmas but I took the letters to spell out eat and then drink and be jolly and then I just added some twine through the letters here and then this is just a little collage that I created in Photoshop and printed on my printer and then cut that out and put that. I had already arranged the pictures like that and just cut it out as one piece in Photoshop. And then again this was arranged in Photoshop and then cut out as one piece and, and put down. And then this, this chipboard embellishment for my mind's eye I put over top of that. And then the little banner that sticks out the side here I created that in Photoshop it just I just typed in Santa was here and printed that and cut that out so that's pretty much Christmas Day so I am finished and what I've done is then just sort of put a page at the end here Merry Christmas I love the Santa and I wanted to have him in and then I just added a, another one of those chipboard embellishments it says Merry Christmas and a little zigzag across the side here I was going to put some letters on here that said uh, see you next year Santa something like that and I used my letters and I put it on a piece of uh, wax paper many of you probably do this sort of thing or use a ruler to, to move it around a clear ruler just so you can get a feel for where you want your letters to be but I didn't wind up using these so what I did is just uh, Put, leave them on the wax paper and then I could put it back into the package like that because you know that oftentimes they don't stick back onto the backing that they came off of especially these thickers once you pull those off a lot of times they won't stick back here so another thing I'll do for these type of things is run it through my Xyron the little X one that does the real skinny strip and just run it through and then you've got some um, sticky on the back of it some uh, adhesive and you've also got it protected like this and I just staple it and I can put it back into my package and file it away for next time but that's just a little tip if that helps you out and so anyway that pretty much does it and I appreciate you stopping by and I will be working on my 2010 I got a backup finish that one too so I'll be back to share some of my pages from that one as well so Take care and we'll see you soon.